Hello dear friends, my name is Filfar and welcome to next uh, open source project uh, named Graph. Uh, I created this also like, uh, it's older project and I'm going to explain you what it does, what you can learn here and then we will look a little bit into code but it's a lot more mathematic so uh, I think only advanced uh, programmers or mathematicians will understand this. So uh, here on the right top we have color, we can change to white or black, that's simple. S as uh, reset, so this will reset the, the graph to the main position. And here you can actually make it more far and more near. So. Let's reset and let's uh, see some mathematical function you can add to graph. Uh, you have to make a syntax. Uh, you have to make a good syntax to make it work. So you have a little warning here. So you have a simple mathematical function here, which is uh, sinus, uh, sine, uh, and tang tangent. You you have all the explanations here and basically uh, cosine, uh, sine and also like, like simple simple functions you should like uh, already know from school. So let's let's try simple sine x. Let's try. We will see what it will do. So you see you, you can see the, the function here actually. So we can we can add another one. So for example, you can add uh, sine times x times x. I mean inside. So let's change the color, for example, for green. And now you can see <laughs> it's multiplying. If you want to make the if you want to make it uh, even bigger, you you can make times two. For example, it should make bigger. Yeah, yeah, it's bigger. So you can basically play. I was uh, using this also in uh, a lot of times in school when we were learning new functions. So this let's pu put this sim uh, example function right now. Turn uh, let's turn it red. So now you can see. You can imagine. Uh, let's go from from complete basic. So y equals x it's logical right because where you have y minus 1 then you have uh, x uh, minus 1 so uh, it's going basically this function is going like straight so it's complete basic then you can start trying like x time x for example let's change the color so now, now you can see it's uh, going because when you are timing uh, minus times minus, then it's like plus, right? So it's like going to only y plus. If if I'm sure, I'm I'm not sure right now. <laughs> uh, it's like really fun to 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 try the function. So inside the code, uh, we have basic HTML where we have values, basic values. So here you can see there are here a mathematical function I'm printing. So we can jump to style. Style is also like simple. It's just colors and the basic things. Then we have a uh, core JS JavaScript. And this is the main uh, JavaScript file that is making graph points. You can see here is the function that is printing graph points and here is pretty much mathematics here, like. But um, I think advanced programmers will will understand this. Uh, I would not, I would not go inside these functions and everything if I would be beginner, honestly. So then we have simple functions. So this is like uh, my universal file for some functions in JavaScript. So this is basic code. Uh, you can download it, you can try it by yourself, uh, index um, HTML you are already, already know. So let's jump into some more interesting functions, more complicated functions.
thank you so much for watching uh, if you like this content please give a like uh, you can try this graph on my URL or you can download it's completely open source so so let's try some creative functions uh, have a great day and bye